it's even though it, this sounds crazy, it's not all bad. I mean, that's, that's far-fetched to say, but... You know, a lot of people are throwing stuff at their TVs here, and you say that right now. All right, tell me what's good. A lot of teams go through droughts like this. Look at right. Alabama before they reemerge. Look at USC before they reemerge. Look at Florida State before they reemerge. We, we get the right system. We get it back and play. We have players that can play. We have young guys that can play. We have a young team. I'm very hopeful what this team can do. But it's got to start today. It's got to start in practice. And I think they need to get taught the right technique. That's what we need to be questioning. Are they being taught the right technique? I'm seeing linebackers out of place. I'm seeing linemen not picking up blitzes. I'm seeing quarterback not making the right reads. So are they so being taught? So you're hearing a lot of things, the same things I'm hearing. It's the coordinators are okay. It's the position coaches, maybe two good friends with Brady Hoke that have been there for a while, that they're not doing what they should be doing in their position. Offensive line hasn't developed like it should. The receivers seem rudimentary, even though they're really good players. Right. And you talk about the linebackers being out of position. Remember, there are kids, local kids. James Ross, right. he's, he's not gotten any better than he was when he was in high school. Guys, this is the point in the show where we usually say, we're going to come back and we're going to talk about the future of Brady Hoke and Dave Brandon. This week, it really gets serious because we're taking tweets and I'm already scrolling through the phone. Mike's just in my ear right, saying, blowing up. I mean, it's, it really is. So we're going to talk about Michigan State and their big win over my, Wyoming. What's next for them is their big team season starts next week. But we're taking your tweets on TV. Use the hashtag 7SportsCave. Taking them live in the cave right after this.